going on guys? It's Blake and today I'm back with another video and today I'm here with the one and only Jonathan Chevin aka Food God and today we're at Soul Stage. I wanted to bring him shopping for some hype stuff, check out some Supreme and all that. I've talked to him a little bit and he has many shoes. He's very close to a lot of people in this whole sneaker fashion industry. As you guys can see, he's rocking the 700s. He pulled it off very, very nicely. Yeah, we have a lot to talk about, a lot of shopping to do and uh, we're gonna check this out. So with all that being said, Let's get into it. All right, so right here, we have all the Supreme Louis Vuitton. I have this one, um, and I have the sweatshirt, but this one is like the perfect size. So somebody got me the black one, it was big, then actually Kim got me this for my pre-birthday six months ago, but I really want this little one, because I, I don't know, that one's just too big for me. That's just like, yeah. that's too big. But this is, I don't know what I could stick in there, my cell phone, my wallet. I know, like a little. And like, like keys, but like maybe, uh, I don't know. But the size, is, it's a lot it's, better, you know? It just fits really good. This is my airport bag. I'm on my way to the airport after. So that's why I got this. I don't usually even walk around with anything, but if I would, this would be it. But today we got, you know, all the jewelry. The rest of it's in here. We got the, the cash and the and, and, and the passport, but, but this is the one. So there's a lot of other things like the baseball jersey and the backpack yep. and stuff. Yep. What are some like what are some other things that you have? Um I have this bag, which the is duffel. amazing. The duffel, the it's small so one though, it's perfect. They have two sizes. Yeah. yeah. See, this one I didn't get because I have the the whole collection. You know what I think about that? Like, if you're gonna go for a Supreme Louis Vuitton, like you gotta go for the one. That I have the pops, original the know? collection of the Morigami, the Louis Vuitton. So I have like the rollaway case. Oh yeah. And then, so to me, that was too much of a cop. It's too simple. The original it looks like Saint Laurent. Is the one. Like this yeah. is the. It's a lot better. So you know, I'll stick with the red. But uh, yeah, the, the whole thing just it, it, like it hurts. It's so good. The quality of this sweatshirt oh. is so unbelievable. Like when you're like, well, you get what you pay for. You literally get. It feels so good on. It's it's incredible. It's a different hoodie than all the other Supreme hoodies. Completely, it just it's, fits it's perfect. It feels one, yeah. so good, yeah. and uh, it's not like a sweatshirt for you know five thousand dollars. Like there's a real special feel to the fabric. It's awesome. And then like wearing it, it's so much like attention. You know? It's so, like, attention for me. Like after well, like you like you like that too. Like, I liked it right for the first month, but after that, when I see people wearing the sweatshirts now, it's a little bit for me kind of played out and it's a, like a little bit late on it. You know what I mean? So it's good. It's good in the first two like first two months. You guys see outside? We got some people watching. Oh yeah, lots of people watching on the street. A lot like of this. a lot of food god. A lot of food god fans. A lot of some other stuff in here, which I don't know if you know about. They have a lot of like older Supreme accessories, like. Like that football, I think goes for almost a thousand dollars. Like these baseballs go for like four hundred bucks. Like it's really crazy, you know. No, so I used to have original Supreme, like the sneakers, the, the ones with the stars on them, the orange, the blue, back in the day. So like I used to be in an office before I was Food God and before I was on TV, and it was on Lafayette Street and Supreme was downstairs. This was years ago, and I was like, what is this? It's like a skate shop, and it was like, you know, there was always people in there, but like nobody knew the culture of Supreme and. Never did I think that little store that I used to see 15 become years ago become like an entire brand doing collabs with Louis. Like this is like unbelievable day. It's one of like congratulations. The it's like yeah, it's it's, it's real deal. And like you could just stick that sticker on anything, it becomes good. I don't know. All right, so right here we have a lot of like the older. Like some of these are old, but they have a lot of like just box logo shirts. I don't know if you know about like you know box logo. Yeah, of course I know. I I'm telling you, I've been in that store since before you were born. Ah! I know Supreme really well. I've seen all, all versions of Supreme, so that's why I'm like, it's, it's amazing. Yeah. What's these going are the, on these with are the new beanies. I love these them. are all the new hoodies. I love. It. I think I'm gonna be getting this red one later today. But yeah, these are all the new this box is hoodies. Amazing right here. Yeah. Both of these are perfect. I knew you'd like some of the new ones, so yeah. maybe you'll check those out. Yeah, 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 I love that. Yeah, but they have so many different things. Like they got goggles right here. If you're trying to flex like that. No, or if you're trying to work with tools, you got all of that stuff. They have everything. Little safe. A lot of I mean, it's just it's endless. You can put Supreme on anything. You can put Supreme on a pizza box, and all of a sudden, like there's a line waiting for it. It's like that subway card. People like started killing them. Like, I, I wanted to take the subway, and I don't even like. I, I think metro. never go on the subway. The Metro card. It's amazing. Did you get one of those? Yeah, I think they only Wait, had them. In, no, they had them in New York and LA. I know, but like you need one of those. They don't have cards. any around here, though. Come on. Like you gotta go to downtown. You need to find, they, they need to find one here for you and get it. Just will look good in your Supreme wallet. I'm telling you. Here, 
to start off, these are the uh, Revenge love Storms. Them. Do you know about them? Yeah, of course. I love them. Do you have any of them? I don't. I so don't. we should maybe look for these in your side. We could. I like that. I've yeah. been wanting them for a while, but like, are there new new ones yet? Because I don't know the I don't know the progression of these or what's been. Yeah, like, so these. I think these what? are like the two newest ones. It's like a weird. It's like a different. Yeah, flag. it's all right though. I like this. Yeah. The same ones. Yeah, yeah. So I'll ask if they have your size. Those are kind of dope. Those are kind of dope. Yeah. The Sean Wallace. Yeah, yeah. I love them. I don't know. They're just. Yeah, he gave me a pair early too. Yeah. It's a perfect color palette. Like it's something about it's it. It's all corduroy. Yeah, it's nice. amazing. I love these. Yeah. So what this, size this, you, by the way? Uh, in Nike, I'm a nine and a half, ten. Nine and a half, ten. Yeah. All right, so, so we'll look out for that. I style. love those. And then we get into the Yeezys. Well, I have all the Yeezys. We could. I have them so all. So what, what can you tell them? You're obviously you're pretty close. You are. Um, your family with them, right? My family. I, I. But I wait like everybody else, you know. And then I, when we get them, and I love them. These are my favorite right now. Yeah. These are my second favorite right now. I think this like this color. It's so perfect, uh, and it just like it like people see you walking down the street, like they know you're coming. But when they see this, everybody kind of like flips out. Look at this perfection. This ice blue is like just incredible. I mean, and I don't know how much you know, but like, does Kanye still pick the colors and stuff on these? I don't know. I don't go that. Yeah, into it a lot of people I don't know feel how it like. Works, but like, I mean, this is. I know this would be his palette. So a lot of people feel colors. like Adidas does a lot of it now. You know? I don't know. I think. He's always very hands-on, so I could not imagine that he would just be like, yeah. okay, it's a pretty big deal every time it comes out. Um, but I'm always like, every time I see them, I'm like, sometimes when I go to their house and I see them, I'm like, please tell me these. Like, I remember when I saw those, like, months and months ago, I go, please tell me this is not a sample, this is real life. Are these real? Are these real? And like they're always like when he's like, yup, they're coming out. Yeah, the gum bottom is like so different. I love it. Everything. I love it. So yeah, right here we have Fear God. We yep. have a couple pairs of these. These yep. ones are actually, uh, these are pretty sick too. I think these were like limited to 50. They're the slip-ons. I don't know if you like the slip-ons. Yeah, I love these. I have these. I yeah. wore them the other day. Yeah. Um, they're amazing. They kind of like, they light up an outfit too. So you can just do a black and you're with pretty that. And you're pretty close to Jerry Yeah, too. I mean, I've known Jerry for a while too. And, and I, I just love his stuff too. I mean, it's I got, I got the, the the black sneakers kind of really before anybody the else did. The basketball ones. Yeah, yeah I had them sick. for a while. I've been wearing them for six, seven months now. Like they Are feel, they comfortable? Yeah, the leather, the leather on those are is like the softest, most incredible Italian butter That's leather that you yeah. would not believe is on a sneaker. Like you guys it's don't even understand. Shoe, it's a that? basketball shoe, but when you're putting them on and your hands go through the thing, like you really feel the, the quality. Yeah, and I, and I wrote Jerry, I was like, this quality of these sneakers is beyond, beyond, beyond. We have all the off-whites off right Off-whites, the funniest part is these are my favorite and I didn't get them. I have, I have every single one of them. The Prestos, you are, have the ones, I missed. The Air Forces, you yep, have these, you yep. sent me a pick of them. I have these, I actually got these and I gave them to somebody else. I, I don't love these. These are my least favorite and I had the white sock on, the whole thing looked weird. With them, what do you so think about the basketball one? Not for me. I love the ones. I love the Prestos. Um, I love these. I love um, what these else? These are complex, kind of exclusive ones, but they have the other ones. You, you yeah. Have and where's the other ones? Well, we're missing something here. Yeah, oh, the, the the higher ones, not the Converse the ones, but yeah, they are missing. With the big swoosh, those yep. are pretty sick. Yep. Do you have those? Yeah, I have them. Brand new in the box. Right here. Oh yeah, I haven't even worn them yet. When the Power Phases came out, I think I wore them through Europe for an entire summer. The leather also on these, you would never believe it because everyone's like, it oh, gets it's like, so much well, people are like, it's too. like the Reebok, it's like the, nothing like the Reebok. The Reeboks are like hard as a rock. You get blisters. This is literally oh, like a, like a Bruno Magli, if you know, like high-end expensive shoes. The leather is like butter, butter, butter soft. That's on. why I really like it, like right here. The leather yeah, is so incredible. Nice. And the colors are perfect. So I went through two pairs of these. Now I'm on my pair of these, and but hopefully summer comes around. There's a new color because the blacks I saw are coming out. Yeah, they're um, all black. But I'll wear them all summer because I walk in the city all day in the streets, and they're amazing. All right, so this is like the Grail Wall, like the most expensive shoes that they have here. Obviously, all the original yep. ones. These go for like the most. The most. I, I mean, obviously we had them before. We used to get these really before everybody got them, and these were the most comfortable of all of them. They fit true to size, unlike the 350s where I wear a size oh, 11 and I'm a nine and a half. These are like the exact size and there's nothing. And they go for so much too. Uh, yeah, I have two pairs of these. Oh wow, $2,000. Amazing. I shouldn't have worn mine. I'm so pissed. I wore them to, to death. There's no soul left. I know. I they're the I most comfortable of all of them. This, grail wall. They this, have this is the grail in the center of the grail wall. They go for exactly. I think this is the, the best center. sneaker on the market, period. It is a showpiece. To be honest, when I saw them first in the in like Kanye's closet, I wasn't sure because they looked huge. And and when I got them. It looks like the Balenciaga shoes. They're just like, I was like, they're not going to look good on me. 
And then when I got them, I wrote them and I said, this is by far the best one of all. Because if you look, this just kills out. I mean, it is like power. So you want they're more colors power, for sure. They're strong. Right? Yeah. I want more colors in these. Like, I don't want these to go away. They kill it with tight jeans. I saw somebody dye them too black. Like, dye this suede. They looked crazy. Look at this color. Are you kidding me? Look at this perfect. I know. It, his it palette. Nice. There's like, I know one does it better. I don't care what you say. Like, it's, it's unbelievable. I got a pair of these. Yeah. These are one of the most expensive on the market for That's Jordan. outrageous. Ones. Yeah. They shouldn't even be out here. 18,000? That's 18,000, they shouldn't even be out here. Do you wear Pharrell's a little bit? Oh, very little. A little bit, very yeah. Very little. I don't I know. They're nice, but they're too, uh, not sporty, they're too casual for me. They're too, yeah, they're not. Because like I like to wear sneakers that I can wear into the night if I have to with these. I feel like I'm not, a, I'm not an athlete, I'm not a runner, I'm not a gym rat, so they're like cool, but they're just something not fully me, and I have to get into them. I want the Chanel's. Please, please, somebody get me the Chanel. They're so sick. They're pr Those I would wear. These are actually a sample. They go for 10 grand right now. What? These aren't out yet. That's amazing. Soul Stage has them. Go Soul Stage. Yeah, they have, they have everything. I like that. Have, I like that. Yeah, I like it. That's dope. And then, what do you think about high top uh, Adidas? They're great, but for me, once again, because like I feel like people expect me to always have the brand new ones. Um, I wear them for for two months, and then they're they're literally all sitting lined up in my apartment. I mean, they're beautiful. You have these older ones oh, here, right? This is just they're classic, you know. Look, I have these yeah. amazing. These I don't have actually. Um, and then the Red Octobers, they surprised me for my birthday when a Kanye shows. I came in the back, Kim's like, oh, come here, I gotta give you something. And that's when they were impossible. Nobody had them, and I saw the people in the pit. Some of Kanye's friends had them. And I was literally sitting, like, in tears, like, I want them. We went in the back, and then all of a sudden, like, Kanye handed them to me, and it's like, uh, from Yeezus to Jonathesis, happy birthday. So it's a signed bag, and it's so incredible. And I, I put them on, it was in an appearance. So we had a, he had a concert at an appearance in the same casino, and I put them on, and I'm walking through, and people are dying, and they're like, I'm like, I cannot believe I had them, they're so sick. <laughs> they're so this sick. is a perfect shoe, another you, when, perfect when I'm wearing shoe. those, I can just feel like, yeah, 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 again, yeah, with yeah, the hoodie. Well, so. there's no more, this is the most comfortable shoe that's ever been created. The there's nothing more leather, comfortable. The sole is really, really Yeah, nice it's amazing, one. it's yeah. amazing. What are these going for? 3,500, but yeah. that is just incredible. Yeah, I got all three of them. I wish I wish he stayed with Nike, to be honest, but what are you gonna do? You this know? is special. That's it's a so, lot of work. so much better That's than a lot these. of work. These are nice, but these are the... No, but those are a work of art. Yeah, you know, exactly. The original is always the work of art. You can play boy. Okay. Okay. Sounds like our friend Murder Murph. He's a supreme playboy. There he is, Murder. Murder! <laughs> Look at this, guys. What's better for Food God than Supreme Chopsticks? Crazy. Blake can't What's use good, chopsticks. Fam? Are you serious? Guess how, much rubber band? guess how much this is. I hope it's not more than like 10 bucks. 500. Get out. I'm out. 500 bucks for that? Yeah. Now I'm pissed. That's a, that, now they got me good with that. I get it for, for everything else, but not the plastic $2 gun. Come on. I'm scared to ask about the chopsticks. How much are the chopsticks? Like 80? 120. 120? The Supreme That's though. like two, two main course dishes at Nobu. 120. So that's like uh Do you guys have any food questions, you ask the food guy. Get in touch with me. If you don't know where Not to go. Murda. Don't ask him. No. You ask him. No, if you don't know where to go, there's only one person that does. Hold on. Yeah, I said it. Nobody else. Nobody else. Let let the ice speak. I am the one and only. Let the ice right. speak. I'm not even gonna speak here, talk to the ice. Alright guys, so we just finished up with Food God. He picked up some Supreme Louis Vuitton. What Louis did you just say? <laughs> some Supreme. He picked up some Supreme Louis Vuitton. He picked up the denim camo backpack. It's pretty sick. He's gonna be rocking it a lot. You I wanna am go gonna be rocking it. Straight yeah. out of LA to Miami, then on a private jet, we're going to London. This is a perfect private jet bag. So if you guys wanna check out his Instagram, all the links will be down below. He'll have a pop tag right now. He posts some of the, he does post the craziest videos and photos with food like that you could possibly imagine. It's all on Food God, that's it. Just that's food it, God. Food God. One word, not two, there's only one. Make sure to go check God. it out. So with all that being said, if you guys like this video, make sure to leave a like down below. I'm just learning the YouTube because the Food God YouTube is coming. Turn on the notifications. For my channel, and then if he has his up in time, it'll we'll be down see. below. We'll see, maybe, maybe. I'm not rushing but it, but it's would, coming. Yeah, tell him who you were with yesterday. Uh, yesterday we filmed like, with- uh, Two days ago. Yeah, whatever. I filmed with Jake Paul, yeah. Team 10, my whole squad. It's coming though, get ready. <laughs> oh God, YouTube is coming. And hopefully we'll have some more stuff in the yeah, future too, yeah, yeah. when Just you're in town. Started.
Just, just getting started. started and uh, yeah, with all that being said guys, we'll see you in a bit. We're out of here. Peace. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you haven't already, make sure to go check out my latest video in the middle of the screen. And I'll see you guys tomorrow.